What's up everybody? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make the dino game of Google using Scratch. So, let's get started. Okay, first of all, I'm going to start by making a cube and changing his color. Now, to make the cube jumping, I need one event block, three control block, so one sensing block, and two motion blocks. Oh, sorry. Now follow my steps please. I'm going to change the numbers. Okay, that means that if I'm going to press the go button uh, and if I press the space, uh, he's going to add 10 to Y and he's going to wait uh, 0 0.55 seconds and then he's going to add minus 10 to Y. Now I'm going to exit the game. Like you see, the cube is uh, jumping. So now I'm just going to change uh, the numbers of uh, the Y. Like you see, uh, the cube is jumping more than uh, the last one. So now I'm going to add uh, some blocks to make it a little bit uh, realistic. I'm back. So, uh, like you see, uh, I added uh, some blocks. Uh, that means if uh, I pr I press the go button and I press the space uh, button, he's going to add ten to I to Y. Sorry, and uh, he's going to wait zero point one hundred and fifty five seconds. Then he's going to add uh, ten to Y, and he's going to uh, wait. 1.0 uh, 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 sorry 0 uh, uh, sorry 25 uh, seconds and then he's going to uh, add uh, minus 10 to y and he's going to wait uh, 0 uh, 0.155 seconds and uh, he's going to add uh, minus 10 to y again so uh, like you see now he's jumping uh, better than the uh, last one uh, now I'm going to add uh, a big uh, rect uh, rectangle to the backdrop I'm going to change his color. Now I'm going to make the cube in this place. And I'm going to add the, this this place. That means if uh, I uh, press uh, the go button is going to be in uh, this place. So now I'm going to make uh, uh, other uh, other cubes. Sorry, 
and uh, I'll come back. A few moments later. Oh, okay, I changed the numbers in the one in the purple square, and uh, I added the new square, um, and I changed the blocks. That means if I press the go button, he's going to hide the, the square, and then he's going to, uh, to go to this uh, location that means here, and uh, then he will show it, and uh, he will uh, come until he touches the edge. If he touches the edge, he's going to hide it again, and he's going to go to the same location again, and he's going to wait one second and repeat it again. Now I'm going to execute the game, and we will go. We're going to see uh, what is going to happen. Like you see, uh, the red square is uh, going right, uh, left. Sorry. Uh, okay. Now I want that uh, if uh, the sprite number one touches the sprite number two, I want that the game stops. So to make it. Uh, like I said, like I've said, uh, I just need the uh, okay. uh, this and uh, this sensor block and uh, one control block. Now, all that I uh, no I no uh, so no uh, all I have to do is uh, to put this in uh, this block, and then if uh, it touches uh, the uh, the sprite number two, the game is going to, to stop. Okay. Guys, I think that uh, I will continue uh, the tutorial in another video okay guys this is the end of the video i hope that you enjoy it and i'll catch you again peace